Hello guys, welcome to another video from Team Fig. This is Hari posting another video which is very technical and related to price and volume. This video is pure technical analysis which will be very very helpful for the people who are especially swing traders and positional traders. Of course it is useful for intraday traders but you should be capable enough to neglect the noises. For swing and positional there will be noises but it will be evidently erased as we are waiting for a potential entry point. Okay. For those who are new please subscribe to this channel if you like this video and share and subscribe comment if you want if you have any doubts. I will be posting about these concepts in my telegram group. If you have any doubts you can just join this telegram group and update yourself with the beautiful knowledge of volume and price okay the link for the indicator which i am going to teach now is in the description below okay. once you watch this video you go to the link and use the uh, indicator well in the trading view and i have not developed this for any other software just for trading view okay without wasting time let's get started with the today's concept one thing you should understand about any stock is the relation of the stock movement with its volume what do i mean by that if a stock is trending in one direction the volume should also trend trend in the sense volume should rise if a stock is moving up the volume also should move up if the stock is moving down the volume should move up meaning the volume should help in every trend movement okay so what is called positive correlation price increase volume increase okay what is negative correlation price decrease which is basically a downtrend volume should increase which is aiding the trend so anything which is aiding the trend the volume should be increasing if if it, if the negative is happening negative in the sense if the volume is not increasing in any of the up move or any of the down move it is just pull back simply it is a pull back okay so with the simple concept in the mind what we are going to learn here is we have a stock which is trending nicely okay it is in uptrend compare it with the price volume correlation price volume correlation is also trending upwards okay if you are going to ask me about this whip source i am not trading at those zones Currently, I am seeing the history of the stock, okay, from 20th February to 5 March, okay. I am seeing the stock. I am just analyzing its history, okay. I am not looking at these whipsaws. On the whole, on the whole, the price and volume correlation is increasing along with the trend, okay. Now, if it is a downtrend. okay if it is a downtrend like this see this is a downtrend in this downtrend the price volume correlation will go below zero okay the olive green which you see is the price volume zero correlation line zero the white line is the price volume correlation line okay if if it is a downtrend the movement of price volume correlation this particular indicator will be below zero if it is uptrend it will be above zero okay if it is downtrend it will be below zero if it is uptrend it will be above zero okay now as the stock is in uptrend okay we also see the price volume correlation is rising higher and higher and it is also moving higher now 
we get a small pullback okay if this pullback is strong downtrend this price volume correlation must be like this okay it should be like this it should go below zero and it is telling that volume is also increasing price is decreasing so there is a change of trend but instead of that it is slowly moving towards zero it shows it shows stock is not interested in the current down move and that is why we got this up move okay do you get my point if a stock is trending price volume correlation should go above zero and it should inch towards one okay it inch towards plus positive one currently it is in 0.4 the highest is 0.4 this here but instead of that instead of that it is cruising towards zero and it is staying in the zero line for some time it also tells that this up move is also a not a valid move the price is hanging towards the zero price volume correlation indicator is hanging towards the along with the zero but the stock is rising it shows this up move is not a valid up move and that is why the stock is falling okay again while the stock is falling the price volume correlation should be below zero which shows it is a negative trend but here the still the stock is clinging to the zeros and it's not going beyond that zero okay and that is why we got this up move okay one might ask where i will enter no i am not teaching that i am not teaching that in this particular video what you should understand is whether this down move is a valid down move or not that is what i am teaching okay in the history it shows it is a valid up move okay and that is why that is why it is also not falling far further it is also not going up high either on the whole what is happening it is trying to consolidate in this region okay so few days back in my telegram channel i gave this stock okay on 28th if you can see this is 28th of march i told this is a negative correlation okay why stock is falling but still the price volume correlation is above zero above zero and it is also falling it is not rising okay it is falling so i told this in this this was the day i posted in the telegram channel it is in downtrend but the price volume correlation is not in downtrend it is still above zero but it is falling towards zero okay but it is still above zero if it is below zero then this is a valid downtrend okay now what i said is there is a negative correlation so that is why i said the stock will go up now look today stock has inch to the higher by 4.7% okay i told this to go long at 1190 now the stock is at 1000 255 okay so likewise if you are a swing trader if you are waiting for a potential opportunity to go long or short while you are trading in futures make use of this indicator okay so i'm just i'm just giving the rules okay you just follow the rules if a stock is trending upward if a stock is trending upward 
price volume correlation should be above zero. Simple. Okay. So I'm just drawing a zero line. So this is a zero line. So let it have the color of olive green I said. So if a stock is trending upward, price volume correlation should trend upward. Okay. If a stock is trending downward, okay, trending downward and it's a valid downtrend, then the price volume correlation should come below zero and it should also trend. Okay. It should also go below zero and it should trend below zero. This shows a valid downtrend. Okay. On the other hand, without a downtrend, if a stock is just falling and if the price volume correlation is clinging to the zero without falling below, if it is not falling below zero, but the stock is falling down, it means it is just a pullback. Okay, don't worry, it is just a pullback. Stay in the trade. If you are already in the trade, stay in the trade. If you are not inside any trade, wait for a potential long opportunity. Okay, if you find any volume concepts, if you want to know about these concepts, watch other videos which I have taught. If there is any potential long entry is creating here, just go long. Just go long without any second thought. Okay. Now, if the stock is in downtrend, we all know the price price volume correlation should also be in downtrend below zero. Very important. Suppose if you have a small pullback like this. If the pullback has crossed the zero and move above zero in a trending manner, then this is a valid trend reversal. Okay. But what I'm saying is this is just a pullback. So the price volume correlation will be like this. It will not go above zero, but it will, it will go up, but it will not go above zero. We might have some whipsaws. I'm not saying it will exactly cling to the zero. We might have some whipsaws. Okay. But it will not trend above zero. During this, you can make sure that this is a temporary pullback and you can wait for a shorting opportunity to short the stock further. Okay. I am sure I have made the concepts very clear for everyone. If you have any doubts, uh, feel free to join in my Telegram channel. Okay, This is the link for my Telegram channel. I am just typing it here. I am also posting it in the description. Volume profile trade secrets. Okay, So this is the link for my Telegram channel. Okay, I request you to join this channel for more updates on the stocks for intraday trade calls and everything. So today we just traded Bharti Artil. So with, uh, we used to trade only one or two stocks daily. So if you want to learn more, join Telegram, subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys. Thank you.